there are cool cats and kittens yeah i decided that this is going to be my new slogan you know if you watched um that show on netflix you already know what i'm talking about but anyway let us jump into today's video um it's all about marie stope so if you've been following the grace cup on instagram you know that yesterday i was at marie stope's um to get my uh, my contraceptive so last week we had um an ig live if you missed it please watch it it's one of those ig tv in one of those ig tvs where we had someone from marie stope's to talk, talk to us about um um abortions uh contraceptives sex everything we talked about most of the things and i think i will bring her back in again so um for me the method of contraceptive that i was i was using before um was nothing it was nothing because the ex that i had had a vasectomy so there was really no point of me taking anything and then we broke up and then now i'm with someone new and this someone new doesn't wanna he does not have a vasectomy obviously um but he he also does not like using condoms so the first thing that we did was um and me as well let me not let me not blame you let me just say he does not want we both don't want so it's a joint discussion that we had and the first thing that we did is we took a hiv test and the test the test kit is like 150 or like 200 from my dawa and in most pharmacies you'll also you can just buy it it's like we took the oral one the one where you don't have to you to prick yourself or like have any blood or anything so we did that but then and then after that i started following i started using an app so i started using my period calendar um if you know me you know from way before i was just the old school type of doing it on um in my diary but then this time i decided okay let me try with the app the app is really great because it even tells you the dates that you ovulate the dates when you have a high chance of getting pregnant days when you have low chance or no chance of getting pregnant so basically just calculating your um your safe days which was good because that's what i've been using you know like i'm like anybody in Asibu, i've just been going <laughs> I've just been playing with this thing and in all my life in all my 32 years i've never ha um, had a pregnancy scare like i've never i've never put myself in a position where i'm thinking oh my god my period is late i must be pregnant i, I mean my period has been late before but i've never thought oh it's, it must be that i'm pregnant that has never happened to me because i've always been extra extra careful about this topic so as much as i think the calendar is doing a good job in terms of tracking the dates and everything i still feel like i i want to take control more control of that and that's why i went to marie stopes to get the to get the pill so my experience going there um they are at icea building by the way which is i think now it's called jaquat building or something jaquat towers yes in town i think that's kenyatta avenue is it i don't know i'm not sure <laughs> but basically but basically that's that's where i went it's on fourth floor um going in it was really nice like the reception and everything consultation fee is what i paid first consultation is 1200 for you to see uh one of the doctors it's 1200 um then after that uh after a few minutes i got called in uh, through the um, uh, to the nurse's place and then office that is and then they check your pressure and then now the question was what what would you like so i told her i need a short-term um contraceptive which is non um non-intrusive so basically there's nothing to be inserted in my vagina or whatever so the obviously the the two options for that then would be the either the injection or taking the pill so we narrowed them down to that and that's the other point that i like to give you like when you go have an idea of the kind of contraceptive that you have so that that you want so that they can tell you the different options and then see what would suit you best so for me um injections <laughs> no well one i do hate needles yes but i just feel like for me the injection is just no no like i don't have like a concrete reason as to why but i've tried i've the last time i used pills was about almost 10 years ago so i've never since then i've never been taking pills except for the occasional p2 here and there um so i decided i want to do the pill again and this is great because then if i haven't used the pill in 10 years it's like my body is my body is 
pill free so it's like i'm doing it's like i'm doing a pill for the first time basically it's like i have a clean slate and i'm doing it for the first time so we discussed the advantages and disadvantages i won't go into so many details because that you already covered in the live the previous live that we did but um basically with the two what she said the similarities between the oh so the injection is for three months it's a, it's a three month injection it will cost you 900 shillings so it's fairly it's fairly okay it's not too expensive um so the injection will last you three months um one of the side effects would be mood swings because it 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 um it affects your hormones so mood swings uh there's weight gain but with the weight gain it has to come with a disclaimer in terms of you're not gaining weight because of the injection that you have or the pill that you're taking you're gaining weight because your hormones is it progesterone or estrogen is going up or going down then it increases your appetite so when it increases your appetite if you don't control your eating and also don't control what you're eating definitely you're going to add weight whether or not you're on the whether or not you're on the pill so you have to be um extremely careful about your diet because then you just have increased appetite so the 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 um, contraceptive itself does not add your weight it's only because you're eating too much uh, and then on top of that we, we took my weight which i'm 75 kilos right now so they took my weight and then after three months you're going to reevaluate and see did you gain the weight did you reduce did you maintain um yeah so so that's that's the thing about about those two and then the so in the end i decided to take the pill the pill that i'm taking is this one microgynon that one it's called microgynon um i took it cost me 900 shillings each it looks like this let me show you that is how it looks like so i took three of these which cost me 900 because each is 300 bob so instead of like taking one and then next month we'll take the other you can take for as many months as you need so i have the rest over here so i took three of them because i want i want to use them for three months how it works is it's pretty easy um it uh you just follow you just follow the dates like that and then this other color these are the placebos meaning on this on the during this time you should be having your period or you should be starting your period so your period should be somewhere here and the reason why because i know i told you i only started yesterday but these ones are already empty the reason why that's the thing is because i got this this is called appeal organizer this one i got from um from kasha it cost seven to it cost me plus delivery it cost me 970 it cost me 970 the the pill itself is i think 770 yes i think it's around seven it's 700 and something basically it's 700 and something um so before the first time when i started when i um when i took the when i was taking the pill like 10 years ago it used to be really hard like you know it's something that you just do as a routine so you kind of you, you don't even register that you're actually taking it so sometimes i'd be taking my pill and then i'm like okay did i did i take my pill this morning did i not did i did i not? then it becomes so confusing so the pill organizer is amazing like the moment i knew i was getting back to the pill i was like i am definitely getting a pill organizer so how it works is these are the days of the week this is monday or through sunday um and then so uh, at the beginning of the week i put a appeal appeal on on every on every day and then on that day i just pop it in and take it um how it looks inside so let me just show you for example for friday for tomorrow i've already put them for tomorrow that's how it looks like so the other pill the pill the pill is inside so i've also put my um my my probiotics these are probiotics that i take every day as well so i was like i might as well just pop them in there as well so that um i'll be taking them together so usually the pill i've decided i'll be taking in the evening because you must choose a time a specific time when you'll be taking so you can't be like today you're taking it in the morning tomorrow you're taking it in the evening uh -uh. it should be if it's 7 p.m then it's 7 p.m every day so for me it's 7 p.m every day like at night i've even set my alarm like a forever alarm so by 7 it has to ring and when it rings i know i must pop in the pill
So the whole procedure or um, everything basically cost me uh, 2,100 for everything, which is 2,100. And then the whole procedure, like me get, getting into the, um, me getting into the clinic and coming out, it was about 45 minutes. It was literally less than an hour. So everything is very efficient. Everything is very quick. The nurses, the doctors there, I really loved um, their reception. And even when you're asking your questions, they're very, they're non-judgmental, you know? So you shouldn't really feel ashamed or you shouldn't really feel judged and especially girls who are underage so say you're 16 or you're 15 and you're trying to get onto the pill or you want to get an injection don't be afraid of going there because that is what they deal with like don't think that your case is very special or that they're judging you i did not feel any sense of judgment it was a very open very relaxed um environment that i really really liked so if you want to go to marie stokes they in the previous video we talked about the places that they are uh, that they they are they're all over kenya by the way you don't have to be in nairobi but in nairobi i think they have like four or five clinics already um so yeah it would be really really good to just go visit them and let them help you especially with your contraceptives your iud's your pills your injections everything and all the questions that you might be having and also if you have like problems with with your period say say you have regular periods or they're heavy or they're this and that and you're not uh and you don't understand it these are really the people to go to anyway i am really curious on how the pill will work will it affect my period will it affect my weight um will there be clear skin or will there be no clear skin like i i'm just i'm very i'm very excited actually i feel like i'm getting into a new journey with this one right now and i want to see um I want to see how that goes so be sure to be watching my period videos because that's when i'll be updating on how i'm feeling and everything for today i don't feel anything i don't feel uh sick or whatever um but i'm sure i'll experience a different kind of period now that i'm on the pill and i'll keep updating you for those three months um just to see how well this pill worked and then finally this is nothing to do with marie stopes uh, but the, the other day i talked about the vagina products that i'm loving and hating I had forgotten to mention this one. This one. It's called Aruba. It's called Aruba. So Aruba is basically um it's an intimate it's an intimate um care I'll call it a, a lotion because it's not a soap. Actually the first day when I took it I did a stupid thing. I didn't read the instructions. So I went to the shower and I'm used to the, the vagina washes. I'm just, I'm just used to like, you just do it in the shower. Like you put a little bit of it, you wash it and then you clean yourself up. Sorry, this works differently with this one. It's after you've showered and you've done everything that you want to do. You just take, you just open it like up like this, take a little bit of it and then apply it. And you're again, you're not applying inside your vagina. You're only applying on the lips. You're only applying on the vulva. What I'm really loving about this one is, um, usually after sex, sometimes you get sore. I don't know about you, but for me, sometimes I do get sore. So this one really helps with that. It really helps with the soreness. Um, they say that it helps with like keeping bacterias, uh, bacteria and whatever at bay. I'm not very sure of that. For me, I personally use it because I love it because after sex and you're just feeling sore and just not right. This one, this one it helps just wash up take a bit of it take a bit of it apply it it just it just it relaxes it relaxes everything anyway thank you very much for watching um let me know what you think about uh have you been to marie stopes would you consider going do you have any questions um i'd really love to know your take on that in the comment section and i will talk to you very very soon you cool cats and kittens okay bye